morning and welcome back to my channel it's still kind of early it's 6 30 now i'm about to walk over to my apartment's gym and get a leg workout in i'm gonna film it for you guys and then i have class today and yeah it's just gonna be a productive day i have some schoolwork to do and then i also have some fun things planned so i hope you guys enjoy this video and don't forget to subscribe and comment down below what you guys want to see You guys, I almost just walked out of the gym with my band on still. Like, okay. <laughs> I'm just doing um, what I do every morning before class. I don't wear any makeup. I just fill in my eyebrows, curl my eyelashes, and put on um, the Laneige lip mask. This is my favorite stuff literally in the world. I stole this one from my mom because I ran out. <laughs> She's probably watching this. But, um... Yeah, I don't like wearing makeup because we still have to wear masks in class and it like makes me break out and stuff. So that's that. That's it. And yeah, I'm just going to get a protein shake and go to class. I think I've mentioned this. So I have a parking spot that's like near where all my classes are because I would have to walk like probably 40 minutes because this campus is so big to what get to my class um, from my apartment just because of the location of the buildings that my classes are in. So I have to drive to my parking spot and then walk about like a mile. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. It's probably like 10 minutes. I like walk super fast, so um, it doesn't take that long. I'm, I'm like used to it now, but that's what's going on. My class starts at nine o'clock and I just showered, um, yeah, got dressed and that's about it. I need to make my bed still. And yeah.
I don't know if I've mentioned this, but this is my third. So I lived in a dorm my freshman year. I lived in Prez. If you go to Alabama, you know what that is. And then sophomore year, I lived with three of my friends, Caroline, Reagan, and Allie. And then we moved again. And then one of my roommates graduated in December. And so I just decided to get my own apartment. And that's why my room's so plain, because I'm just going to be here for a year. And I didn't think it was, like, worth it to, like, put all the money into... Oh, I'm so out of breath. Put all the money into decorating my room for, like, one year. You know what I mean? Because I'm about to graduate. So, yeah, if you were wondering why it's very, like, bland in here, it's not bad. But, like, usually my rooms are, like, so cute. I'm going to insert pictures from sophomore and junior year. I had the same, like, theme. But, yeah, it was so cute. I loved it. And... This room just wasn't big enough, I feel like, for... I had, like, pallets as my bed frame. I don't know. I'll show you so you understand. Okay, I'm gonna go to class now. If you've seen my other vlogs, you know I'm obsessed with these protein shakes. They're just the Owen um, protein shakes. Vanilla and chocolate is good. They're 35 grams of protein. And, yeah, I just like drinking these after I lift. I literally forgot the most important thing. My jacket. I'm gonna be freezing. 39 degrees right now. Like, am I serious? I just got in the car and I was like, why am I so cold? I'm usually like fine when I get in the car. No, I don't have my jacket, my puffer jacket. I'm literally just in like this like kind of thin sweatshirt. One thing I hate about going to school at Alabama during like this time of year is when I go to class, it's like 30 to 35 degrees. And then, and I'm like layered up because I don't want to be cold. By the time I get out of class, like all my classes, it's like hot. Like I'm like sweating. It's like 60 degrees and I'm like dressed for winter. And then I have to take all my layers off and carry my jackets. I don't know. Little rant. People ride around on those scooter things and almost hit me. All the time. I just got in my car after class. It's 9.56, I'm freezing cold. My hands feel literally like they have frostbite. I can't believe I forgot my jacket. But anyways, I'm gonna go home, get my headphones because I left my AirPods at home and I wanna go to Panera and do, I have to write a paper or finish writing a paper. I'm like halfway done. And then I have a Zoom class that's at 12, so I'm just gonna log on to Zoom from Panera. So I'm like so mad that I left my headphones at home because that's the only thing I need to go home for. But um, yeah, I'm gonna go home right now and I'm trying to think if I wanna get something to eat like now or like later and there's this guy staring at me, still staring at me. What are you staring at? Excuse me? He's still staring at me. <laughs> like, is he okay? Oh my god, I've literally never had someone stare that hard, but yeah, I'm gonna go home now. I'm back home now. I'm just folding laundry. I decided I'm gonna make like brunch because I really only had that protein shake this morning and I'm getting dinner at this Mexican restaurant tonight with Mary and um i want to be hungry for that so i'm probably going to make lunch now then go to panera for my zoom class finish writing my paper and then probably bring a snack to panera so that i have something to eat um before dinner or in between lunch and dinner it's not really right before dinner but um also i do not wake up at 6 a.m every single morning only on mornings that like i know i need to have a productive day and i have a lot to do so, by any means, I do not wake up at 6 a.m. But I do find that when I do, honestly, like, I'm less tired. The key to it is, like, you cannot go back to sleep after your alarm goes off at 6. Like, once you press that, like, that snooze button, you're literally just going to be 10 times more tired. So, like, this, the first alarm that goes off, just literally get out of bed. And, honestly, I feel like my energy levels are, like, way higher when I do wake up early. I don't know. It doesn't make sense to me either, but... I want to start doing it like at least two times a week because um, my schedule this semester is just like very busy and I have classes like throughout the day so it's hard to like go work out and stuff so I like doing it in the morning just to start my day off with a workout 
And yeah, I just wanted to say, do not wake up at 6 a.m. every morning. This is not like an everyday routine, but this is a productive day. This is the gluten-free bread that I use. I just, this is like my first time buying it and it's actually so good. And this flavor is really good too and it's gluten-free. So on top of the bread, I put this Kite Hill Dairy-Free Cream Cheese. If you haven't tried this, I highly recommend. I like love it so much, it's so good. It's such a good alternative to cream cheese. Um, I honestly like, like it better, but that. And then egg white omelet, as you saw, with tomato, onion, spinach. And yeah, I'm just gonna show you guys some of my like favorite um, like things right now, like food wise or drinks. You guys know I'm obsessed with these protein shakes. Um, if you watch my videos, you know. I'm obsessed with Poppy, Celsius, this almond milk, the unsweetened vanilla is so good. Um, this is the hummus that I like. This Yellowbird Blue Agave Sriracha is literally so good. I bought it last week and I'm halfway done with it. Like I use it on everything. I'll use it for this meal as well. This is like my little snack pantry. This popcorn is amazing. I've had it the past three nights for dessert. You can literally have so much for a serving size. It's like an entire bowl and it's just like very clean ingredients. Um, so yeah, and this flavor um, is so good. The Himalayan sweetness, there's other flavors as well. And then these Crunchmaster protein crackers. I love having these with hummus. Um, the late July tortilla chips. I like these ones and then I also like the Siete ones but they were out. Um, I always just like having these little rice packets if I feel lazy. For dinners and then I like having the apple cinnamon rice cakes. I have chocolate rice cakes, regular rice cakes. I've talked about this um, protein Catalina Crunch cereal. They have a bunch of different flavors. Um, yeah, this is really good with almond milk for dessert or just like a snack. I just talked about this bread that I just got, which is so good. I always talk about this almond butter. It's literally like my favorite thing in the entire world. I usually like, I used to be a peanut butter girl, but this almond butter, I'm telling you, it is so overpriced, but like it lasts me a while and I'm obsessed with it. Like I cannot stop buying it. Just finished doing my hair. I never curl my hair. I literally always straighten it. My sophomore year, I curled it like every single time I went out. And then I just stopped doing it. I don't know why. Like it, my hair's so thin. So like it doesn't take me a while to do it. So I don't know why I haven't been doing it. But I'm just wearing this corset top with these jeans from a boutique here in, South, in Alabama, I believe. In, but I don't remember the exact name. It's in Midtown, I know that. Um, so yeah. And I think I'm gonna wear my dunk clothes. Cause look, it matches like perfectly. So I'm wearing these. That lighting is hitting though. Hello. We're back again. Okay, Every guys. Friday. We're going to, I look naked. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But we're going to Central Meza. Wait, yeah, is that how you say it? Meza or Mesa? I say Mesa. You always say Mesa. I know. I don't know why I say Mesa. But we're going to go get these Mahi Mahi bowls, I think. That's what I'm getting, at least. 